All right, we're going to be firing this 1895 Chilean a little bit. It's a 7 millimeter. Uh, I was actually uh, able to dig in the archives and found some uh, proper 7 millimeter stripper clips. They are a little bit different than the 8s. It's loaded just like any other Mauser. Cock on closing. The sights are actually uh, set up for a 400 meter battle sight. I'm going to try a few shots at the steel plates to get on top of my sights and then we'll try grouping it at 200 yards. How high? Two feet. Okay. Well centered though? Seems to be. Still a little high. Okay. Just about dead center of this round steel plate. All right. Gun's not shooting bad, but it's still real high, even at that distance. Upper right quadrant of the white just outside of the black ring. On the bottom or top? Bottom right target. All right, I'm going again. Alright. Alright, we've been grouping the Chilean a little bit. Um, I didn't have a chance to fire it today at 100 yards just to see what that kind of accuracy would be like. I grouped it at 200. We'll have a look at the group in a minute. Hopefully it's somewhat decent. It's kind of hard to see what I'm aiming at. I'm going to lob a few of these heavier grain bullets into a bullet trap here. Um, just over 300 yards away, roughly. Bullet trap is roughly about 12 inches. A little high? This high. Yep. Got it. High into the right. I see. Wasn't high by much. No, a couple inches. Good. Yeah, you're uh, you're putting holes through it. <laughs> it's okay. Yep. Can weld it up. Same line to the right. You put some right in there as long as you do your part. Oh, yeah. The point of aim was actually down here on this target, and the rounds impacted right there. One, two, three, four, five. 
that is a um, 200 yard group out of the Chilean. Definitely not bad accuracy. I think it's got a lot to improve on.